All right. Uh, another question dealing with this, except now instead of the Taylor expansion of the charge distribution, we do a similar method with the current density. Suppose that the current density changes slowly enough that we can, to a good approximation, ignore all higher derivatives in the Taylor expansion. Then, J evaluated at TR is equal to JT plus TR minus T, J dot T plus, and then higher order terms, uh, which we don't really want. Um, for clarity, I suppress the R dependence, which is not an which is not the issue here. Show that the show that a fortuitous cancellation yields B of R and T uh, is equal to mu naught over four pi J R prime of T cross script R hat over script R squared D tau prime. Okay. Again, our last uh, uh, example or exercise used the electric field of the Jefemico's equations, and this time we'll use the magnetic field. Again, hopefully my pronunciation gets better. All right, um, well, let's go ahead and try this along then. Well, in this approximation, we're dropping the higher derivatives of j, so j dot at tr is equal to jt uh, dot at, uh, or excuse me, j dot at evaluated at the retarded time is equal to j dot evaluated at the uh, proper time. And thus, we see that if we plug these in to his equations, uh, in purple, we just have to be careful. And uh, then we plug in the approximation that was given. And so with that, just plug and chug it away. And uh, you see that we push that uh, second part, script R over um, C, into uh, the red as we try to factor out one over script R squared, uh, just to make this uh, simplification easier. But we know that TR is equal to T minus script R over C, so TR minus T is equal to negative C or negative script R over C. So when we plug that in for the J dot term R prime T, um, and so on and so forth, uh, and we sho and we shove in the fact that for the higher order approximations, j dot tr is equal to jt, that a uh, uh, red c, one over c, jt goes to uh, j dot at t, and the j dot in the purple times the tr minus t goes to negative r over c, j dot, and wonderfully enough, they cancel, and we're left with, with exactly what we wanted. So, a couple of things to do with the approximations and of course the substitution and we're good to go.